Hello, this is the headlining news across the East African region. From Rwanda, Rwandan opposition politician has dismissed charges of incitement and forgery against her as politically motivated. Diane Rigara and her mother appeared in court on Wednesday with prosecution demanding a 15 years jail sentence for her and 22 years for her mother on similar charges. The two women spent over a year in jail before being released recently on bail. They have put up a spirited defense at the trial. News from Southeast Sudan. Southeast Sudan is said to become the world leader in violating children after surpassing Syria and Afghanistan over the past four years. The UN Special Representative for Children and Conflict, Virginia Gamba, says that among things, children in Southeast Sudan are forced to commit atrocities against their own families so as to completely break any links they have to their past. Moving on to Kenya, fire has raised Jikomba Market in Nairobi, destroying a lot of property and merchandise. The early one is the morning fire, however, did not cause any human casualties. In June this year, a fire that broke out in the same market killed 15 people. Uganda in Kampala. Preparations are in high gear for the concert to be staged by musician turned legislator Bobby Wine this weekend on Saturday. The concert will be held at his own beach called One Love Beach on Lake Victoria in the southern outskirts of Kampala City.